As police officers, quite often we meet people during one of their worst moments. One of the things I envied most about Steve was his patience and willingness to find something good in everyone he came into contact with. Powerful words from Brentwood Police Lieutenant David Roy as he and thousands of others said goodbye to Officer Stephen Arkell. Arkell died in the line of duty while responding to a domestic disturbance. WMTW News 8's Ali Miles was at the procession and the service in Exeter. What you're seeing behind me is just some of the hundreds of agencies that we've seen here for this processional and outdoor memorial service for Officer Stephen Arkell. They came in droves, whether on wheels or on foot, with heavy hearts. Thousands of uniformed men and women paid their respects to Officer Stephen Arkell, thanking him for his sacrifice. This police officer from a small town allowed each of us to go home. He sacrificed his tomorrow for the future of this so we Arkell served for 15 years with the Brentwood Police Department. His fellow officer, Lieutenant David Roy, was a lifelong friend and neighbor of Arkell. Make no mistake, Steve cared. Steve loved this town, this community. He loved serving all of you. Speaking directly to the fallen officer's family, he told them just how sorry he was for their loss. It is the emptiness that they will feel in the days, weeks, months, and years to come that weighs heaviest on the members of the Brentwood Police Department. For no person or thing can replace the light that Steve was in their lives. Both police officers and firefighters from Maine came to pay their respects. Kettery Fire Chief David O'Brien says this isn't about different states or different departments. It's about a brotherhood. It's something we support our brother in the police department and like they would support us in line of duty deaths and in, the, uh, in, in our world. And with a final last call, thousands said goodbye to Officer Arkell. No response from Brentwood 87. Although you were gone, you will never be forgotten. End of watch, May 12, 2014. We will have the watch from here. May you rest in peace. Arkell leaves behind a wife and two teenage daughters. Reporting in Exeter, Allie Miles, WMTW News 8.